All right, since this is a couple of days after tarantula feeding video 41, um, haven't really fed the T. gigas baby, so I guess uh, for this video I'll show you how I uh, crush the crickets and uh, give them food. Um, first, I have to see which ones I fed already. First, I uh, fed that one, the one that molted a couple days ago. Or at least so, I think. So I have about six of them to feed. Okay. Now this is how I feed slings. Um, you could feed them fruit flies, and they'll work uh, great. So let me find a cricket, a little victim. So the way I do it is take it, hold its head, split it like that. There we go. Then I give one here, and I give one over here. Yeah, so that's two of them down, and uh, four more left. Got sixteen of them. Some of them will actually grab crush crickets, like that big one I showed you. I'll uh, show it to you again. Well, actually, which is the one? Yeah, this one right here. That one grabbed the crushed cricket. So that's how I feed um, little baby slings. So I'll show you these four. Maybe we'll get an attack. Who knows? We got one of them there. That one's second in star. Some of them are they're growing like weeds, guys. There's another third instar. The third instar, that one. And a fatty. Okay. So we'll take another cricket. Take a little smaller one. Sorry, this is uh, disgusting. Yeah, okay. So let's open them up. Here's uh, one. Close it up. So this video may be uploaded probably tonight or tomorrow morning because I don't have any internet or uh, cable because they're changing the cords around the neighborhood oh god okay this one's pretty fast there's another one these are cute so maybe no that one didn't get it <coughs> so we're at 21 Fed, two more to go. And this is the last cricket. Okay, and open these up. And this one's on the glass. Gotta be careful, these are very, very fast teas. Uh, these are one of the fastest in the world. So if I ever sell you one, you really be careful. one and the last one da, da, da. And I have a uh, golden Yoshi returns uh, uh, hack video I just made it yesterday I'm gonna upload it today if I have internet and he's on it's in French uh, oh a Hans tree spider, or a Hans sapin, I think is what it's called in French. I don't know. My French is not that great, but and there you go. That's how I feed Tabanikinius gigas orange tree spider babies. Cool. And I guess for the record, I'll uh, look at my um, 
P. Smithy. P. Smithy, where is it? See how that one grew? It's about an inch. Oh! Look at that. Newly molted Grandma Stola Rosea red color form. Awesome. <laughs> I can never get this one to eat on camera. That's what that's the problem with Roseas. They're how should I put this? Very, very picky eaters. Sweet. Now it's sort of uh darkening. It's still May fifth, uh, two thousand ten. I'll probably be doing uh, the Alex Awaity video probably uh, tomorrow or the next day. Been busy with um, work. So I did, well, posted earlier showing you that my G. Rosea molted. And now uh, I just got one more. I'll just, I'll just stick it into this video. Uh, Cyclosternum uh, Schmarte. Yellow banded bird eater. So there's the molt. And the tea is over there. Fortunately, she's. Oh, there she is. There. <laughs> I was wondering where she was, and that's the molt, and. Well, bits and pieces of it. Yeah, she's right there. Uh, probably around two and a half inches. About the same size as my fasciatum. Just a little bit smaller. Cool. Anyway, so I uh, hope you enjoyed this uh, video and uh, stay tuned for the Alex 080. And I have a lot to say about him. And believe me, these are not kind words. Alright guys, take care. Bye.